Hello everybody, welcome to the software review section of uh, PC Michiana. This is the first of many software reviews to follow. Today I'm going to discuss, believe it or not, a commercial piece of software. Now before you all run away, commercial software isn't the devil. Uh, I do like to occasionally use commercial software, even though I oftentimes prefer the freeware alternatives. But I was given an opportunity to review Super Anti Spyware Professional because they decided to send me a copy for reviews. Also because your guys' support, uh, they noticed that you guys were happy with where the videos were going for now, and uh, they wanted a genuine, honest review of it. Now I told them that uh, I wouldn't do it unless I was honest with about with everyone about it, and they were completely okay with that. So we got to give them props for that. They said we would be doing you a disservice if I lied about it. So I'm going to go ahead and do a quick review of Super Anti Spyware here, Professional. Uh, if you've been watching the videos before, I have done a review of the free edition. I'm very happy with the free edition. It is a decent piece of software. I don't like the fact that it runs real time in the background. In other words, it starts on your Windows boot up without asking you. And it runs in the background in your quick launch down here in the bottom right hand corner. Uh, even though uh, you don't tell it to and you have to go in there and manually disable those things. Well, the professional version really isn't any different. In fact, the professional edition includes real time protection. Now. Let me clear the air of some misconceptions I may have uh, sent some of you. Real-time protection isn't all in all a bad thing. If you are in a situation where you have family members or friends who constantly go on your computer and perhaps go to websites they shouldn't, maybe they use software such as LimeWire, maybe they're accidentally uh, easily deceived into going to those websites that say click here for additional protection, then you uh, may find real-time protection beneficial to you. And that being said, Super Anti Spyware is a good piece of software for that because it has a small footprint. Now what's a footprint you ask? A footprint is uh, the amount of resources it chews up while it's running in the background. Now notice right here, Super Anti Spyware on my computer is only chewing up about 2.4 megs of memory. For those of you who need to be put into perspective, one gigabyte of memory is 1,024 of those. So as you can see, it's a very small footprint. Now, that's really nice when it's running real time in the background. So that's one definite plus with the Super Anti Spyware software. Now, the scan your computer on the quick scan and complete scan works just like the free edition. In fact, the free edition is no different. So basically, these are both still great. Probably not the best in the market, but they both, uh, they both are reasonably fast. Uh, so I can't really give them discredits for that. Most of us are going to run a scan and walk away from it anyways. We're not going to sit here and stare at it. Their definitions are definitely good. Uh, they've uh, been consistently uh, kept kept up with a decent rootkit scanning. Uh, I've used their freeware version long enough to kind of develop a, a, liken, a likening of the, the definitions they've got. It catches things that both SpyBot and uh, AdWord do not catch, but again, all that's still available in the free version, so it's hard to get you to upgrade a professional for that. Another thing it does is uh, the full version lets you do a scan um, according to the following schedule, so it lets you set up a custom schedule. I don't like to do scheduled scans, but for those of you running on a PC, I'm on a laptop, so it's kind of pointless. For those of you running on a PC, like I said, who uh, people use it periodically throughout the day, that might be a very useful tool for you because you can have it run every night and remove the spyware at the end of the night. So that's another great, uh, great thing to have, if, if, again, if you aren't the only one using your computer. Now, basically, that, those are the only differences between the commercial version and the free version. So it all comes down to what's it worth to you. So you have real-time protection, so it does real-time blocking, it does first chance protection, which examines over 50 points of your system each time it starts up, which is nice. So it does a real-time scanning when you boot up, which means it's checking your uh, boot log, and it also does real-time scanning when you're shutting down in case anything tries to run before you shut down your computer, which is common with spyware and adware. So that's really nice for those real-time ones, and it lets you do the scheduling. Now, what's that worth to you? It might not be worth a whole lot. To me, it's not. Completely useless to me, in fact. I like to run my real-time scanning uh, in non-real-time. I actually decide to, uh, but I, I'm not a high-risk surfer. Do you see what I'm saying? So I don't really need any uh, scheduled scanning. I do all my scans manually, and uh, I usually go through them maybe once a month and I make sure nothing's running in the background. So this product wouldn't appeal to a person like me. But if you're that kind of person, you will probably find this piece of software useful. Uh, the professional version is $30, and what kind of irks me is they do charge you a $15 a year fee. It's not that unreasonable, but uh, I'm not a big fan of yearly recurring charges on any kind of software. Now for additional $10, they do allow you to subscribe to a lifetime subscription. So actually if you pay $40 up front, which is a bonus, you will get a full lifetime subscription to it. 
Now, that means you're gonna invest $40 right up front, which to me is a little, ugh, little expensive, um, but at least they give you the option of doing that because I'm not really a big fan of, of constantly paying every year. Let me go ahead and click the Compare Free versus Professional Edition. And what you'll see here is you get uh, quite a bit more protection when you're doing the, using the Pro instead of the Free Edition. Uh, it lets you do the system diagnostics, which is, which is pretty nice, automatic updates, uh, which not very essential. Uh, I do all my updates manually, but if you're a person who doesn't like to mess with it, uh, again, that's something you get to work with there. Uh, scheduling, I don't use that, but that might be useful to you. Registry protection against browser hijacks and other things, this is very nice. Um, if you use Internet Explorer, if you don't use Internet Explorer like I don't, then you don't need to worry about that because most of the browsers that are hijacked are the mainstream ones. Real-time blocking, again, this is extremely useful if you have a lot of people using your computer. And first chance pre protection prevention, this is pretty unique to uh, super anti-spyware, um, and it, it actually isn't offered on a, a lot of other uh, uh, anti-spyware softwares that are out there. So all in all, I'd probably give super anti-spyware three and a half to four out of five on my review. Uh, the definition system's solid. Um, I'm not a big fan of real-time scanning in the background, but pretty much every commercial copy of that anything worth purchasing will offer you that feature but uh, the biggest problem is is you know what is it that strikes me what is it that makes me want to buy this product instead of use the free version or use a free version alternative and I have to be quite honest with you there isn't a huge huge uh, benefit to me personally to drive me into buying it so that's why I give it a three and a half out of five not to mention after installation uh, during installation it doesn't let me disable it on startup it doesn't let me uh, decide whether I want to do automatic scanning. It doesn't run me through that first quick setup, which is kind of uncomfortable for me because I, I want to customize it right off the bat. I want to tell it exactly wh what kind of personality I am. I want to tell them I don't like automatic updates. I want to tell them I, I don't like instant scanning in the background. Let me fully customize it right after I install it. And you can do it easy, for, so easy enough for everyone to understand, and they'll know what they want to do or what they don't. So at least give people that option. Um, and again, there's so many alternatives out there right now. I do believe that Webroot, uh, Webroot anti-spyware, I think it is, is number one right now in the market for commercial. And price comparison-wise, it's almost the same. So it's like, well, I can get just about the same protection or better elsewhere. So three and a half is probably about fair. My recommendation to a super anti-spyware is probably lower your price. Um, it'll appeal to a lot more people and it'll convince a lot more people to try it over the alternatives and uh, probably to uh, do a little better job of uh, allowing users to customize their experience right when they install it. Uh, but, you know, that might just be a personal preference thing on my part, but keep up the good work on the, uh, the scan times, the real-time scan times and the footprint, because it's, it's probably the best feature of the software is that it's not going to chew up your resources, and that probably would make me choose this product over Webroot alone, even though the definitions aren't as good, and even though the... Uh, Real-time scanning might not be as good. I prefer, if I was going to run something in the background all the time, I would prefer to use up less resources than I would uh, prefer to be more thorough. So that being said, I hope this helped some of you out. I hope you guys enjoyed this review, and it gives you a little better picture of how Super Anti Spyware is. I want to thank them for giving me the opportunity to review their software. Don't forget that the free edition of the software is available at my website, www.pcmichiana.com. That's Precision Computing Michiana. We are based out in South Bend, Indiana. Notre Dame! I don't know if you're a Notre Dame fan. I'm uh, sorry if I offended you for saying that. Uh, bottom right-hand corner, you have free anti-spyware software. You can download the free version of Super Anti-Spyware. This one offers you the full system scan capabilities and updating, and it lets you disable the on boot up uh, section of it, which is nice. Just got to do manual updates. And uh, give that a shot. I think you guys would really like that software. It's actually part of my Hello World series on one of the highly recommended pieces of software to download. And uh, don't forget to also please subscribe to my videos. It's a lot of encouragement when you guys do. And don't forget to leave ratings. I always like when you guys rate. I hope this has helped you guys out. And I appreciate you stopping by and hope to see you again soon.